There's so much we take pride in at Villanova when it comes to our basketball program, but hoops mania is something that no one does in the country. This is a sold out event entirely attended by students that has a passion in the pavilion that no one in the country can match. Our players love it, they have a great time. It's the students, it's the players, it's the Villanova basketball energy celebrating the start of another great Villanova basketball season. You can call him Will or just coach. Thanks for coming, guys. Thank you for coming. But make no mistake that a beautiful night in October is the perfect background for Villanova's one-of-a-kind way to open the season. It's a first chance to meet the team and for everyone to show their best moves. And the competition for bragging rights can be fierce. But judge not, lest ye, well, you know. I always believe, you know, people should remember what you do, you know. There's no point in just doing something just for the heck of it. You know, I want people to remember my dance. And, you know, Grease actually was, it's one of my favorite movies. And uh, I was just happy to do it with my partners and, you know, do it for Hoops Mania. You know, I'm a great dancer. And, you know, I had two great partners. And, you know, we, we, did, we did our performance. You know, I, I watched everybody else, and I seen, you know, a couple other people doing it. And I thought, you know, they, they're really good. You know, I don't, you know, I think we have a chance of winning. But, when, you know, when those lights came on, you know, I just turned into a different monster. So, you know, I, maybe I was a little raw. I don't know if uh, the judges got paid off or something. But, you know, I, I definitely think that it should have been closer than it was. But, you know, I enjoyed myself. Appreciate that trick footwork. Coach Dudley, what do you got for him? Yeah, man, my guy, Come on, man. Like, no. Uh, I practice, I actually practice after practice. Like, I, I would practice with the dancing and do my routine, and then I would practice again with my partner separately. And he gives me an eight. He has his opinion, and uh, I really feel like I should have got at least all nines and tens, but hey, I mean, it was all good and fun. Um, you know, I think I got snubby a little bit. Um, I thought I was the best one out there, you know. No one else can dance like me. Josh, I love the jazz hands, but I'm giving you an eight, my man. Eight! A nine! I'm going with Coach Dudley. I'm giving you an eight, Josh. An eight! You know, the judges, whatever happened with the judges, you know, happened. But, you know, deep down in my heart, I know I was, I was the winner. So, you know, it is what it is. Hart's dance teammate from last year and defending co-champion was next. You know, it was me, him, and Chris were trying to get a little group, you know, this whole four years, trying to run the tables, but now, you know, he got one up on me, so, you know, you know, I'm coming for him. I gotta, gotta get that one back next year. Later, it was time for everyone to dance, along with this year's special musical guest, Schoolboy Q. The only place in the country you start the basketball season with that type of celebration. Villanova's basketball program, Villanova's students, there's nowhere like it. We had a great time, little controversy with the judging. Darryl Reynolds wins two in a row, and we're ready for the basketball season. I hope you are too. Here we go. That'll do it for our first edition of Inside Villanova Basketball. I'm Jay Wright. Go Cats. <laughs>